Hi guys, welcome to another edition of QED Hot Topics. My name is Kelvin Okoroji, and of course, you know I'm not doing this alone. I have with me in the studio, Oro Lua. Oro Lua, welcome to the show. Thank you. I'm here to discuss the trending topics. Right, so let's just let's just get into it. So, um, on Monday, uh, a video went viral. A video alleged to be that of uh, Tua Savage uh, went viral on the internet, and so far it has caused a lot of reactions you know on social media celebrities nigerians even uh politicians are yes. uh, talking about uh, the video so uh, i just want to hear your thoughts first of all before we go into the issue just hear your thoughts on the video what do you think about the whole situation well i think it's very i don't know what to call it but right now i'm just hoping that she's as strong as she's proving to be because she hasn't really reacted to the old saga she's just been moving up the light i hope it's really true that she has moved on and not somewhere sad and depressed and, and yes of course uh but then again we we were we, some people were conflicted about the identity of the the the, the, the woman in the video why somewhere of the opinion that that's actually not a she was savage yeah. and then others were like making comparison with the hair the hairstyle the fingernails you know saying that this the, the whole uh of physical attributes and all that matched with uh, her description so do you actually think that that's I that do. i do but i think a video surfaced earlier okay. before this one that came out on monday and but there was no face to that video so people were not like okay she the one she's not the one but this particular one she like the outfits even the inner wear the nails the hair the jewelries were still the same with the one she the picture she posted on her instagram page when she was when she went to ghana yes for vacation. yes so, so like it's this like it's so similar to not be true yes yes yeah. yes but 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 the, the 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 big question here is how how did this happen i mean how did a someone of her status because wow. right now tiwa savage is considered the number one female artist yes. in nigeria so how did this happen how how do you let such something like this slip past you well at the end of the day i don't think you can control what people want to do um in their intimate moments okay as much as you say oh don't do this don't do that mm. some people will still do it still i think it should be the blackmailer at the end of the day because you cannot have that kind of video and the next thing you think of is to put it on social media and all of that though they are great mistakes from their parts anyway but at the same time nobody should do that to anybody and and again and again we have to also acknowledge the fact that the video only showed uh, the lady's face, face. Like, no, we're saying the lady's face okay. now because we can't really say if it's, it's Tiwa. It's, Tiwa has not even said that, you know, uh, the lady in the video is her. So the, 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 the video just showed the lady's face. So what about what about the, 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 the guy? That's where it gets me confused. Exactly. Because in an interview, she said um, the, the, her boyfriend mistakenly posted a video, the video on Snapchat. Snapchat yes. And then snapchat that i know it is not you cannot post post like random you don't post random yeah. videos so yes i think she should a number one suspect she even with the guy yes how can you mistakenly for the in the first place why are you taking the video she didn't approve of because i don't think she consented to it uh, yes she gave consent to the, video. to the video and she actually if she is the one in the video she looks drunk or something yes that's so another I think, thing i don't know he's the first suspect to me i think he to, to me if this was really high in the video i think it sets her hope for Okay, so uh, one more question. What do you think about uh, the suggestion that the video was intentionally posted for publicity stunts? I don't think so. I actually do not agree. I just, what I believe is that the boyfriend yes. actually has for, for the most faults in all of this. In all of this, yes. You don't tell me you just mistakenly post, post that kind of video. video. Like showing just our face. Yes. Uh, like that's too... Well, uh, I I do feel I do feel for her. I, I'm I'm really sorry that something like this uh, happened to her, and uh, I'm hoping that she comes out of this strong. But well, just like every other Nigerian scandal, it only happens for a week or two, and then we're moving next on week. to the next. We've forgotten about <laughs> it, and you know. So I think she should just take it easy. I like the fact that she has not really addressed it. You know, fish in any official capacity. She's just living her life. Yeah. She even um 
uh, posted a video today yes you know to mourn the the victims of the end sas protest yes, so yes. i think these are the signs that she you know she has moved on from it so i think nigerians should also move on you yeah. know since she has moved on we should move on and then celebrities that are always posting her pictures and standing a queen a queen you know standing her and calling her a queen i don't think it all of that it's yes it's dragging the whole thing. issue so everybody should just you know chill, chill let go. and let, let it go it so we can just move past it and then move on to the next drama because this october <laughs> this so october has new. so much for us <laughs> all right guys that's all we have to take for today but um when we come back we will be discussing about the end sas protest so don't go away we'll be right back mm -hmm.